DeAndre Jordan uh, joining me right now. DJ, I just saw you catching up with Karis LeVert. What was it like catching up with your friend there? Oh, man, you know, we all love Karis. We miss Karis around here. Um, he has done great things for this organization during the time he was here, and um, it's, good, it's good to see him, and I'm glad he's, uh, he, he's recovering from his, uh, from his surgery. You guys, talk about this game. You guys had given up 120 points in seven straight games headed to tonight. You hold <laughs> Indiana to 94. What kind of step do you feel you guys made defensively tonight? Well, I mean, you know, we've been getting our <laughs> kicked, so uh, we needed to come out and, uh, you know, make a stand on the defensive end first. Like I said, we got a lot of guys who can score the basketball and create and play make. But defensively is where we need to come out and, and you know, just kind of make our stand. And that's what we did tonight, and hopefully it can roll over in these next games on the road. We talked yesterday about the frustration against Detroit. Heading into this game, you knew you had a tough matchup against Demonis Sabonis. He had 12 <laughs> points, 13 rebounds, a season high, three blocks. What was your mindset heading into this? Um, just for me to come out and be aggressive on the defensive end. Uh, the ball finds energy, so a lot of my teammates will get me the ball, and, uh, you know, when they're doubled, and I get a lot of easy, wide-open shots, so I'll take those. But defensively tonight, I wanted to come out and put my stamp on the game and just, just be aggressive on that end of the floor and let everything else take care of itself. Appreciate you, DJ. We'll see you out west. All right, great. Thanks.